It's not every day that scientists discover new animal species in the middle of the country's largest city. But that's what happened when a group from the University of New South Wales and the Australian Museum set out to survey a tiny island in the heart of Sydney's congested harbour. Clark Island, which lies off densely populated Darling Point, was the subject of an original survey in the 1870s and 1880s by renowned marine biologist William Haswell. Haswell identified more than 100 species of marine crustaceans and other invertebrates. 130 years later, UNSW students, academics and Australian museum experts set about discovering just how many of those creatures remain and what else may lie undiscovered in the island's varied habitats. William Haswell was a, originally a Scotsman and he moved to Australia for, for health reasons. Uh, when he came here he, he did extensive collections of the marine invertebrates. Uh, one of the nice things that we could do today obviously would be to rediscover some of these missing species. Uh, they're all small crustaceans, little shrimp-like animals that live in amongst kelp forests and uh, shallow subtidal regions. High on the most wanted list are two species of isopods, small shrimp-like creatures that were discovered by Haswell but haven't been seen since. So they've gone missing from these locations. It might be that they've become locally extinct or it may be that we simply haven't found them yet. Having collected hundreds of specimens in just a day's work, it was back to the Sydney Marine Institute of Science for the process of identification. It's an onerous task. If you were to sample all of the invertebrates in about a metre squared of kelp forest, uh, you'd likely to get in excess of 10,000 individuals. Identification of the hall may take some weeks, but already the team knows it has discovered several unnamed species. They also found a shrimp-like crustacean called an amphipod, previously only found in Hong Kong. 